Welcome, fellow shroomers, and today is the awakening day for myself, meaning it is Mount Rush Day because it's day nine of my actual main account, and today is where I can drop all of my gems. As the title says, I have over 150,000 bad boys we are going to drop on this mount, and hopefully, we get a decent positioning. But more importantly, it's going to level up my mount. So, let's get into today's video. Hello fellow shroomers and you know what to do, my name is Mr Sneak and smash that like button and hit the subscribe button, there's a load of you, over 90% that love watching the videos and you're not subscribed, so why not just subscribe because then you get that daily upload from myself, right? So today we are opening and basically using a bunch of gems because right now the very important event is out and a lot of players keep wasting their gems in the early game and they don't realize this event comes out and it's basically called Mount Rush and you get four rounds of doing this as you can see I'm on round one of fogs I've not done any of it and you're gonna get 2,000 hammers for completing each stage and for doing this you're going to need to feed it 800 times every single stage so if you do a quick little bit of math that's 3200 hammers you're going to need to be able to buy if you want to complete all four rounds of this right and as you can see if you are trying to push this as a big big boy you can see the ranking rewards on the top right first you're going to get three extra little skyrider tokens and some nice gems on top of the more important cool thing, the top racer gift box for your um, alliance. But you can see everyone in the top three is going to get the two, two, and three. And then everyone else in the basically one um, in four to ten is going to get one on these little Skyrider passes, right? And the reason why you're getting those, if you are wondering, is because if you go back into it, there's the rush shop, right? And this rush shop is where you can buy mounts for your like skin should i say mount skins for your mount and they give you cool stuff right and one for me that i'm gonna be getting because i'm an archer player is gonna be a pyre breaker it's gonna be a very fantastic one for me and then later down the line maybe i might try and grab maybe cloud drifter i am debating about it i don't think i need this but we'll soon see in the future right because i have got a couple of tickets tokens as you've seen so in order to participate in this event it's nice and simple all you gotta do is come down to the bottom here where it says the shop and obviously you can spin all your gacha area but if you go to the fourth tab across this is your supply store and obviously you can see there is some money stuff here to do with diamonds but if you just scroll down you can buy some speed ups but more importantly is those clock winders right you can get one thousand for 3500 so you can see i'm easily going to be able to go one two and three and guess what we'll do a fourth one that's 140,000 gems and it means i am going to complete all of the pass on today's video for you and i'm going to see if i'm going to need this right we've got 16,000 left over and we're not going to just waste gems if we don't need to waste them right so now here's the fun part we are now going to use all of this to upgrade our mount and the only reason i've got this leveled up to the plane if you are wondering is from prior events and as you can imagine going into your dungeon and completing your chrono towers right this gives you two keys and if you do the ads you're going to get another two keys keys for it so i would always recommend doing that it's going to give you more and more obviously um upgrades for your mount so let's do this let's start this bad boy we're going to just start upgrading this up and we're just gaining a ton of power every time and boom and if we go across we need to get as you can see another amount to get this star up right because we're still in the plane if you're wondering right so if we go over to the rush ranking rewards the mount rush we can start claiming all of these tabs right so boom claim confirm boom claim confirm confirm and you can see i'm gonna get so many rewards for doing this right so that's all claimed now boom come out and that is all for completed so if i come out of here the reason why i've got all of those rewards you can see my gems has gone up to twenty one thousand. i can now go to my spear artifact and spend all of those hammers i've just gained and now i've unlocked my even artifact and now if you look i have it equipped so my damage output 
is going to be nuts right now, right? So I'm going to be able to clear, especially if I hit the challenge button, I'm going to be able to clear this boss where I was easily stuck at before with no problem, right? So really, really good event. And if I look into the actual Mount Rush, let's go to the rankings, right? I'm rank 17. And the thing is, I do want to go to the next level. I kind of want to get that next one, right? So let's kind of upgrade this to the next power. So if we go back into the shop, we can hit the supply store, boom, go all the way down to those clock winders. And we're going to go on this next area. And we're going to basically buy the full 21,000 boys. We're getting 600 more, right? Because we're probably going to need more anyway. So if we quickly hit that, boom, quick upgrade, and we're almost there. I just need 600, right? So hopefully today, from just completing <clears throat> my Chrono Towers here, I'm going to be able to get this to the next tier easily by either end of the day or the start of tomorrow, which is a very massive push of power for myself. You can see I'm on 8.7 million power now, and I am steamrolling through all of this content. So I can't wait until I start hitting this lamp too very soon to get to level 100 and finally finally evolve as you can imagine to my final form which is gonna be the arrow god right it's gonna be a really fun time being an arrow god so as soon as we get there we're gonna dish out a massive amount of damage and we'll be pushing forward to the plume monarch which is our awakening phase right so i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video i hope you've enjoyed the push of my mounds and we're almost there to the next stage and if you know what to do already smash like comment and subscribe because i've got some a massive announcement that's gonna come to this channel as well from my main channel in the first of may that's gonna save you guys a ton of money in this game and it's with a massive sponsorship with one of the guys obviously that you will definitely know if you're a spender in this game of legend of mushrooms so until the next one stay safe guys stay sneaky and peace out